Hi everyone, it's Andrea. It's that time of the month. It's time for a small haul. I will say it's a small haul. I haven't bought much. I think I've got 10 colouring books and I've got a few supplies, but not very much. Um, February will be a bit different because I have already ordered some pencils, um, which won't be coming until Tuesday. Um, first of all, I've got two packets of the Link Shines. I've got a few of them here because I've already opened them and it's just the green and the black so I ordered ten, a pack of ten black ones and a pack of ten green ones because they were the ones I was short of. So I've obviously taken them out and put them into a, a pencil case um, just because I like those coloured, those pens, I use them a lot and um, I'm just going to buy a couple of packets every month of the different colours until I've got them all. I did buy another set of the Monarch colouring pencils. We all know these, these Black Widows. The reason being is that two of mine from the Black Widow Monarchs are very, very, very low. I haven't, as you see, I haven't opened them, um, but one of the blues and the very last one, um, this one here, is it that one? Uh, that's mahogany, no, it's rusty. I've used and it's near the end. I love it for hair colour. I used it a lot in uh, various things. So I've just bought myself another set. Now these were I think £28 when I first bought my first set. But these were down to £16 something on Amazon when I got them in January. So very pleased with that. So I guess this is going to be a very, very, very quick uh, haul video because I haven't ordered that or bought that much. So on to the colouring books. I mean if I, get, I have a month where I buy hardly anything then obviously... I will roll it over to the next month. So on to the books. The first book is 50 Spiral Mandalas by Camellia Angel Cova. As you know, I've got quite a few of her books and I do like it. Now, I've coloured in this one, as you can see. There's a little tag in it. Because <laughs> part of my plan was to try and colour in them as soon as I got them. I've managed that with two of the ten, so it's not too bad. So, yeah, 50 Spiral Mandalas. It's, they're really nice. You know, as you know, I like using my glitter gel pens in them. And uh, so you'll be seeing one of those done in an, another one. Yeah, really enjoy it. really like these uh, pattern books. Of course, I'm still a subscriber of Colour in Heaven. So I have this one, which is the first one of 2021, which is the Mermaid Special. I haven't coloured anything in this one yet, although I do want to. I just haven't had the time. There is a full flip through of this book on my channel if you wanted to have a look. Part of the reason is they are terrifying because they are so detailed. So that's the sort of thing, it puts me off a bit, but I will colour in one probably in February. So yeah, I, mean, I love my Colour in Heaven books. I've um, got quite a collection growing now and I do want to stay a member and, and a subscriber for as long as I can. I got I'm sure I haven't shown you this one. I'm sure that there was this. I got this at the beginning of the month. It's relaxed with our issue. Yes, it was this month, definitely. Uh, issue 75. And as you see, I have coloured in this one as well. This was the second book I managed to do a picture in. These ones do have quite a lot of detail in them, but they're great for markers. Although I did use pencils on my picture. So I'm, I'm going to skip past the picture I did. There's lovely patterns as well. So you can do with your markers as an ice skater. I think that's quite a cute one. Because um, I'll be getting Maria Trolley's new book, Luna, soon. It's not out in the UK yet, I don't think. Um, I did get Flora. So other than Droom Reese, which I haven't got, which I will get, I've got them all now. So I've got all the ones that are like this. I think I coloured in one this month, did I? Well, you'll find out. I'm not sure. <laughs> You'll find when I do it, but I haven't coloured in this one yet, so I really like uh, Maria Tolle's work. There's some, look at that, that is stunning. Look at them, they're beautiful pictures, very f fantastical. Some are really detailed, and then some are a lot simpler, like this one. So, if you wanted to just colour something and you didn't want to spend a lot of time, you could just do that. You don't have to do a full page background, you could just do a little shimmer around the edge. So I do like these, I think they're beautiful. And I like these hardback books. They just look so nice on your shelf. I also got 
Yampus Dreams Collection. So this is um, a book of, a compilation book of Yampus uh, Dreams books. So Carousel Dreams, Sugary Dreams and Flowery Dreams, but also Finches, Galaxy Dreams and Magic Bottle, which I think have only been available on Etsy. This is such a thick book. There's so much in it. And pages are quite thick, so I think they'll take a bit of water. So I plan on trying all sorts of different mediums in this, from watercolours to alcohol markers with obviously a bit of paper between it, uh, to normal water, normal pencils, um, water brush markers, all the, the sort of stuff that we have in our collections and maybe we don't use as much as we should. I'm going to try them all in here, possibly even all in one month because I want to have a good go at this book because I just love it. I think it's gorgeous. Next one I got is... Chibi Girls Grayscale, Chibi Girls 2 Grayscale by Ava Brown. This is the first of the Ava Brown books I've got and they're very like the Jade Summer books. But, again, I like colour in these and I like the grayscale. I mean, look at them, they're lovely. I think there's two of each, yeah. So there's two pages, so that's cool. I don't mind that. If you make a mistake, you do it again. Look at the one with the ice cream, how cool is that? You can let's do it again, or you can let somebody else have it. I'll probably let Jennifer have them when she's older. I mean, she's three now. She still doesn't colour properly, but she's getting there. She sort of understands it goes in the lines, but she still only uses one colour most of the time. So, so I like that one. I thought, well, you know, Jade Summer hasn't put anything out, so I'm going to get this one. So I like that one. Then I saw on somebody else's channel, again, um, uh, Dainty Damsel's Val Collections by Jay and Sheets. And I thought I'd get the Valentine's one. Um, these are really cute and um, they're not huge. This is smaller than a normal book. So if I put it there, you can see it's not a lot smaller, but it's slightly smaller. Um, but again, it's, it's very thin paper. It's not brilliant paper, it's Amazon paper. But of course you put a piece of paper underneath it. And you can uh, use your markers or your pencils. I'll try both. Obviously, we've got Valentine's Day next in, in February. So that's why I thought I'll get this and have a go. Of course, it doesn't have to be done in, in February for Valentine's Day. You can do them anytime. Same as you can do Christmas and Halloween anytime. Because let's be honest, we all like to colour witches and fairies and stuff like that. <sighs> Excuse me. Now the last three are again Relax With Arts. Now I didn't pick these up at the beginning of the month but this is the pocket book. As you can see this is really small. So I'll just put Ava, Ava, Ava Brown next which you can see. So this is like one that would fit in your purse, in your handbag. Um, I thought this would be nice just to have, you know, if I'm going anywhere, not that we are going anywhere at the moment as you know, but you know I could put it in my handbag, take it down to my mum's once we're allowed to visit and some put some pencils in or a pencil case in or some markers in. Um, they, they're just really sweet little pictures, normal style for this sort of book. There's pictures of birds and patterns and people and houses and little pattern of purses and chains and some rabbits. It's quite cute. Look at that, sleepy. So you know, they, you know. I thought, well, why not? Let's get it, and I can just pop it next to me while I'm holding Jennifer downstairs, and she's watching TV, and I can have a scribble. Then I got the Home Sweet Home one, and they have something called the Holiday Collection, the Holiday Special. Now, for some reason, they should have a Holiday Special almost every month because we had one for Christmas, and now we got one again. And so, not sure about that. But uh, these ones are slightly, obviously, it's a lot bigger than that one, and they have a different paper to the the normal one. The same paper as the pocket-sized one, but different to where is it? This, which has a shiny cover, as you can see, and it's it's the same height, but it's very thick. There's more um, pages in this one, and again, there's some thumbnails on the back. The girl doing the makeup is really cute there. I like that one. I have, yeah, I've got a Christmas one where I've still got it on the go. There, yeah, this one is people were saying it looks like her bum's out, but it's just the way the jodfers are. <laughs> Which I thought was quite funny. I have the Rome Winnie Caravan, that'll be nice and to colour. And the couple in the boat, and there's a, a windmill, and a guy with his dog. So they're just nice little pictures to colour when you, you know. They're a bit more detailed. They take a little while to do. That one's not too bad. That's kind of a nice one with the pies. So there's that one. 
And then of course I bought the next one, issue 76. <laughs> I should stop buying colouring books. I only bought 10. Ten's good. Um, so this is issue 76, as you can see. I probably colour in this one this month. Again, you can't see all of it. That's a pattern. So you've got the sun up here. And then I'm not sure what this is down here, but I kind of like it. And then you've got a butterfly there and some flowers. And there's a cute... I love the Cupid. The Cupid's really cute. And then this is a nice one. The girl in the dress and the flowers. That That's a nice one to do. I might do that one. There's some birds. So they're all sort of different type so and then again that's not gonna take long she's like hi look at my wardrobe <laughs> or this is my shop <laughs> who knows but yeah there's some nice easier ones in there and there's some more complicated ones in there that's a nice one uh yeah and, and what they do in relax with art is they have this little gallery here you see these six so these are paid pictures that um people have colored and submitted on their facebook page um I don't know what from what issues, but they look good, don't they? That's from the Christmas one, one of the Christmas ones. So yeah, so it's kind of like uh, Colour in Heaven, they put, but they put out like two or three books a month, depending. I don't think the pocket ones come out as often. That's issue 38. The holiday special is issue 37, and this is 76. So this one is the one that's monthly. I think that's probably quarterly. But yeah, so a few... Uh, colouring books there that I bought this month don't tell anybody I've already ordered one for February and some pencils but there you go something I wanted to try so you'll be seeing all that on the channel in February um, I hope you've enjoyed this uh, very small haul for me I will admit I've normally got a lot more but what with Christmas and Jennifer's birthday and Paul's birthday and Paul's mum's birthday all being in January it's been a bit difficult my mum's birthday is in February so that's next but yeah, I'm, I'm really pleased with the few I've got. I'm very pleased that I've actually coloured in two of them already. So if you want to see flip throughs of any of these books, if they're not already up, you just let me know and I will pop a flip through up. And uh, obviously if you want me to colour in any of these books, leave me a comment down below which one you'd like me to colour in. I don't mind at all. And I hope to see you in the next video. So take care guys. Bye.